so this is gonna be my first car vlog I don't really see too many vlogs or at vlogs at all of single people or single women doing vlogs of their life or talking about what's going on with them I mean I guess I do but like people who don't have kids and don't have a boyfriend or a husband or some sort of significant other in their life because I think those vlogs are like really entertaining to watch especially for me like I like watching it's Judy's Life, Gay Babe TV, Natural, Dear Natural 85 because these are people who have families and it's like you get to get a glimpse inside of what it would be like because some of us want that life so bad but you don't know what it takes to keep it or even to get it or what it really takes to maintain it so did I just say that I don't I think I said that I don't care um, but yeah that's I enjoy watching it for that reason um, also I like watching socialite Sandy and her husband then now this is a couple who doesn't have children yet but they're living it up they stay in the gym they keep each other on point they're having fun you know it's a sec they're like a sexy couple they're like I don't know it's just hard to explain they're just like that 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 couple that you know they're having a lot of good sex they're having just a ball in life and that's I would want that if I don't have children I would want that that type of relationship where I me and my husband we keep each other on point we keep each other on our you know our game our a game we keep each other career wise inspired weight wise like we you know if you see your you see your significant other gaining weight you don't just let them gain weight. You, you you tell them. You be like, listen, babe. You know you you know you put on a little bit of weight. Just like that. Like I would want my man to tell me. Like don't let me be neglectful of myself. Which at this point in my life, I wouldn't be. There was a time in my life where I was super. That's how I got like this. Now it's like I was super neglectful of myself and the relationship that I was in. He wasn't helping me. He was like making it worse. So. But that's what happens when you don't care about yourself nobody else will so in that instance I made decisions after learning lessons from that that I want a relationship where me and somebody are together I want it to be us working together not oh um, I'm just in this by myself and if I gain weight he's not gonna call me on it or if he's gaining weight now if he looks good with a little bit of weight on him I'll tell him he gained some weight but I'm gonna tell let him know I think he looks good but once it starts to get to a point where it's unhealthy you know you, you have to keep people in check you know especially in relationships that's not just about oh I just want somebody to be there you're there to help that person grow and be the best person that they can be and that's what I want I want my man to you know help me be the best person I can be but anyway so socialite Sandy and our social light life TV I love 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 their vlogs also um, another couple who's childless at the moment which I hope that word is not offensive some people get offended by the littlest things but being a childless couple does not mean anything bad that's a great thing in certain cases but it's Tony Daly or Tony and the boy oh my god I just I just found their channel recently through Gabe babe TV because Gabe was talking about her hair and I guess Tony had made her some wigs and so I was like who is this Tony person so she kept talking about it and then they were in the vlogs and I was like oh my god these two are hilarious and so I subscribed to them and I love them like they're there's this is another couple who's sexy they keep each other on point you know they eat healthy together they play together they work together I love 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 them so anyway like I was saying I don't really see too many single people vlogging but I'm gonna vlog my life and see if it helps anybody who's like me who you're out here in the world <laughs> you know what I'm saying you're out here you are single ready to mingle <laughs> you're not necessarily looking to get married tomorrow but you're not less looking to stay single your whole life either like right now what I've been through which I'll get into in more videos going forward what I've been through relationship wise at this point all I am looking to do is build friendships meaning if I'm attracted to somebody let's start as friends let's be friends for a very long time until we get to know each other and then we decide whether or not we want to take it there but and by take it there I don't necessarily mean sexually I mean take it there by developing romantic feelings sex sex is something that a lot of people just put too much weight on on sex and that's another video in and of itself let me reword that people put too much stock in sex in dating situations 
there should be stock put into sex when you're in a committed relationship that's headed towards marriage or in a marriage but truthfully you shouldn't be having sex outside of marriage anyway because i'm a christian just had to put that disclaimer out there just so people don't get it confused in my beliefs but if you are sexually active and you are single meaning not married because if you're not married even if you're in a, a committed relationship you're not married you're technically single so if you're in that kind of situation the weight sex does mean more but when you're dating like sex is not something you should just be putting out there for everybody everybody should not get to experience you every guy that you like and that is attracted to you or that you're attracted to does not need to experience your body like it's it's a very fine balance and there's there's times where you may really love somebody you may really fall in love with this person but it comes to sex you gotta stop short because you know that it's not gonna lead anywhere anyway but that's you know those are life lessons that you learn which I'll probably get more into in another video because I definitely want to get into talking about my experiences not just to talk about them but to maybe help somebody or maybe somebody give help me and give me some feedback or what I where I'm fucking up because I'm doing something wrong apparently so anyways okay so my friends here so see you later bye